Oh, the, the, right. Say that again. If you're going to adjust the trailer brakes, you leave the tractor brake set on the truck mm -hmm. and you press in the red valve for the trailer. Okay. Okay, so it releases the brakes on the trailer. It applies. That's the applied. That's okay. when the brakes, that's when they're applied. And this right here is your slack adjuster. Okay. And right now we've got like a half an inch. Okay. You cannot have more than two inches right here. Okay. If you have two inches or more, it's way out of adjustment. That's okay. bad. Okay. 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 And that's it for the brakes. And if you have to adjust the truck brakes, then make sure your trailer brakes are set so it can't roll. Okay. And then you engage the yellow valve to release okay. the truck brakes. And then just do the same thing. Okay. If you want to be extra safe, put a pair of chocks. Yes. And you want to be extra safe, do what? Chalk, chalk the wheels. Chalk the wheels, so okay. It roll. So. Okay. And that's it. I mean, brake adjustment, really, it's easy. There's nothing difficult about brake adjustment. It's simply doing it. It's doing the effort it. of getting down on the ground and, you know, and doing that. But if I'm stuck at a scale out of service because I got one brake out of adjustment, you're, you can damn well bet I'm going to get on the ground and get that thing adjusted. And, and have get it over sign with. It off and get the hell out of there. And how long does it take to do that? This? Uh huh. Five, ten minutes. Okay. To adjust one? If I gotta adjust all four of them, it takes a little longer. Okay. Yeah. Five minutes on each break? Something like that, yeah. Okay. If that. Like I said, it's harder for me to flop my ass around on the ground <laughs> to get to each one than it is to actually do the adjustment. All right.